Have you ever wondered what the difference really is between organic versus non-organic foods? Listen and take notes. Have you ever wondered what the difference really is between organic and non-organic foods? In the studio today, we have invited Melinda Tomini, who is a nutritionist. She'll explain the difference between organic and non-organic foods. Melinda, thank you for joining us in the studio this morning. This is a fascinating topic. Could you please explain for our audience the difference between organic and non-organic foods? Thank you for having me. Organic food items are produced using processes that use no synthetic substances. Non-organic foods, on the other hand, use synthetics to produce the finished food products. Right. Organic foods are not genetically modified, whereas non-organic food items can be modified by their producers at a genetic level. Mm -hmm. Organic foods typically contain the same amount of nutrients, vitamins and minerals as non-organic foods. However, foods that are organic do not contain pesticides. OK. Many people choose to buy organic food in order to avoid artificial chemicals. Nevertheless, evidence suggests that the risk of exposure to pesticide residue in foods is small and unlikely to cause harm. Interesting. In conventional farming, farmers use pesticides to eliminate the outbreak of pests, while organic farmers rely on birds and insects or traps to get rid of the pests. Fascinating. The organic farming process is good for the overall environment. In contrast, non-organic farms typically produce more waste and use more energy, which damages the environment. Mm. Although organic foods have less environmental impact than non-organic foods, many people may choose to buy non-organic food because organic products are often more expensive than non-organic foods. Uh huh. Another difference is that organic food is only available in season. On the other hand, non-organic food is available throughout the year. For example, Organic apples disappear from grocery stores in late winter, while supplies of non-organic apples may be overflowing. I see. Thank you for explaining everything so clearly for our audience. Come back any time. Thank you for having me. I will. Did you notice what transition words I used to talk about the difference between organic and non-organic food. We use transition words such as while, in contrast, although, even though, on the other hand, whereas, nevertheless, however, to show contrast. Non-organic foods, on the other hand, use synthetics to produce the finished food products. Organic foods are not genetically modified, whereas non-organic food items can be modified by their producers at a genetic level. However, foods that are organic do not contain pesticides. Nevertheless, evidence suggests that the risk of exposure to pesticide residue in foods is small and unlikely to cause harm. In conventional farming, farmers use pesticides to eliminate the outbreak of pests, while organic farmers rely on birds and insects or traps to get rid of the pests. In contrast, non-organic farms typically produce more waste and use more energy, which damages the environment. 
Although organic foods have less environmental impact than non-organic foods, many people may choose to buy non-organic food because organic products are often more expensive than non-organic foods. On the other hand, non-organic food is available throughout the year. Organic apples disappear from grocery stores in late winter, while supplies of non-organic apples may be overflowing. 